guys doing today? My name is Anthony Ganji. I'm the host of this show called On The Line. Welcome to another episode of On The Line. Uh, guys, I want to talk about the title prison guard versus correctional officer. Is there a difference? For me, there is. You know, when I started in this profession, we were called correctional officers. That's what the rules and regulations have said. That's what the laws have said. It's a title I've learned to have a lot of respect for because for me, we do a lot behind that wall. And I figured correctional officer, that title of officer, <clears throat> really showcases that. I mean, guys, we're facilitating programs because we're getting, you know, we're making that movement happen. We're providing environments that's safe and secure for those uh, programs to run. We're getting medical appointments where they need to be. We're getting mental health appointments where they need to be. We respond to codes. We investigate concerns. We save lives. We save lives. I mean, that goes way beyond what the term prison guard may reflect. Now, guys, when I say this, I am not minimizing the importance of that term. That term has a strong history with us, but that's a history. We have evolved. So with that evolution comes the fact that we need to embrace where we are at today. We're in a world that's forever moving. Inmates are constantly out of their cells. We're interacting with them a lot more. So the thing is, going back to that term prison guard, it's kind of a very simplified notion of what we do. Now, for us, we have an idea of what prison guard means to us because we lived it, it's our history. But for the public, they don't understand that history. To them, prison guard is simple. We stand in a world that doesn't move, we guard things, we warehouse inmates. That's not the truth. When we go to defend our position, we have to defend it from a higher level. And that means that we have to embrace the titles and labels that bring this profession to a higher level. I mean, I'll be at tables once in a while and they'll say, oh, look at this prison guard. Look what this prison guard did. Oh, that's okay, because they're just prison guards. No, we are correctional officers. That's our title. We're a lot more than what that label says. We go above and beyond. Guys, that's not even just behind the wall. There are officers, correctional officers that were involved in cleaning up 9-11, trying to save lives. There's correctional officers that do a lot of work in the community. There's correctional officers that train police. Again, being part of that law enforcement family. And I think the correctional officer title, that title of officer, that kind of lets people know, hey, wait a second. Wait a second, these guys may be more than just guards. These guys may be peace officers. They may be law enforcement professionals. And again, that's key for me. That's always been my mission. When I opened up Tear Talk a few years back, when I worked for Corrections One, it was the importance of embracing that title and letting the public know that we are law enforcement and that fight. But it was hard to fight with that older label of prison guard, but became a little bit easier with correctional officer. And how many times would I have to go back and correct someone from the media and say, hey, listen, great article that you did, but you used that word or that, that label of prison guard. It's not accepted. It's not because we're more than that. And the public needs to see that. The public's not going to see that with that simplified label. So sometimes we have a little back and forth over this because there are some people that still remain loyal. What I'm asking is to understand where the evolution is, to understand the public's perspective. Because the thing is, I want to bring recognition and respect to this profession. We deserve that. And it's hard for us to get that with the label that the public sees as something very simple. I want to take it up a notch. I want people to embrace us as correctional officers. There's a level of professionalism with that, and there's a level of respect when it comes to that word officer. But I would love your thoughts. As always, guys, my name is Anthony Ganji. Thank you for watching this latest episode of On The Line, and there are more to come. Stay safe, everyone.